Hello, for today's tidbit, I'm going to go back to basics. All the way not just to dance shoes, but to shoelaces, actually. Um, if you're one of the people whose shoelaces look like this, where the bows hang evenly on both sides, well, this probably isn't the video for you. You can go back to watching cat videos or whatever you're doing on the internet today. However, about half the people I meet have shoelaces that hang like this, where the bows hang unevenly or maybe even vertically down their shoe and instead of across. And no matter how you try to adjust it, they kind of wind up here. Uh, a lot of times these wind up double knotted um, or they just come untied all the time. Um, this is a sign that you're actually tying your shoelaces wrong and there's a real easy fix to uh, make it so they don't come untied while you're dancing or doing anything else. Uh, as they say on the internet, I've got just one weird trick that's going to fix all of this. Now when you're tying your shoelaces, most people take their dominant hand and throw it over for the first knot. And then they use that same hand to throw over to make the bow. And that doesn't work very well. You wind up with this thing that's diagonal. And if both knots are tied the same way, they loosen the same way and they tend to come untied pretty easily. The fix for it is to tie the knots against each other so they come untied in a different way. So I'm going to take my non-dominant hand, throw it over. It's going to feel really weird if you've been doing it the other way your whole life. Then the second knot, I'm going to tie the way I always have. And just with that little change, it's going to sit neatly. This isn't going to come untied while you're dancing or doing anything else. That's it. It's an easy one today. I hope you're having a great time, and we'll see you at the Ballroom Company.